What do the Yankees feel they can get out of Luis Severino and Domingo Herman? Right, that's the $100,000 question, or maybe it's a million-dollar question, because you look at Severino, and perhaps he's a pitcher for you in June or July. Herman is someone who you hope comes right out at the start of the season and can be a pitcher for you. We've talked about Herman and how he is, has to come back and be contrite after being suspended for the domestic violence issue. But this is something that the Yankees are happy. He deals with the off-the-field stuff. Well, the on-the-field stuff is starting right there. In the winter leagues, four shutout innings, seven strikeouts. So, Bob, he has several steps to get himself back to where the Yankees can say, hey, let's put Herman into this rotation. But that was the first step. And you look at the other contenders for the rotation and the innings that they have pitched over the last two years. It's Garrett Cole and then it's the rest. Garcia with 145. So obviously you're going to have to find a way to eat up some innings. It doesn't seem that James Paxton will be back. Jay Happ will not be back. Tanaka is a free agent. Obviously we talked about it on Monday. The Yankees would love to bring him back. Is that going to be a possibility? But you are going to need a veteran starter somewhere in that rotation if nothing else to eat up a lot of innings because with the subtractions of Hap Paxton you're, you're losing a bunch of innings Tanaka they're gonna have to find a way to fill that out Herman is very interesting he took a great first step last night on the field I think the Yankees are going to be paying more attention to how he handles himself off the field to see if he can be part of next year's rotation